Yo, welcome to my first playthrough of Man of Medan on Xbox One. I was a huge fan of Until Dawn on the PS4. Um, to me, I'd never watched a horror film or, or played a horror game with such an awesome uh, story. Like, I really thought it was just like a serial killer type uh game or film but it was just much more than that the twist the lore i hadn't, i didn't know anything about it other than the pictures you see on the the box you know and trailers and i thought it was amazing so i'm really looking forward to playing this i had to buy this straight up this looks really good The last game I've uploaded to the channel was Evil Within 2, so I'm on a bit of a horror binge at the minute. I've got so many AAA games on the shelf that I still need to play. I've got tons of 360 games, Xbox One games, PS3 and 4 exclusives. But uh, Every time I finish a game I just randomly choose the next one and this is what I chose after Evil Within 2. Let's start it. Oh fucking hell, user agreement. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Whatever, whatever. Skip to the end, except I just want to play the game. Whatever, mate. Let's go. Skip. Yep. That looks good enough to me. Don't play alone. Play alone. Or you can play with friends. Special features. Hey, Jeeves. Show me the history of... An oh, okay, I'll be happy to watch these after. I roughly read about what this ga the ship that this game's set on. It was really interesting to me. So, uh, fuck it, we're doing solo. I've always loved playing these types of games on my own. Maybe do a co-op playthrough in the future, but who knows? It's hard to find decent co-op players out there these days. But anyway, let's do it. Chinese market, China, South Sea. New story. New slot. I'm gonna put my legs up for this, man. Like watching a movie. Squeaky old chair. I haven't even like played this yet obviously and I'm, I can't wait to see what type of story they release on their next game. Got my surround sound headset volume high. What's this? World War Two, Vietnam. Oh, it's so what one about? They're in Chi China, South Sea. Are we going to find out who those dead soldiers were? Buster, we better mosey on back to the ship. <coughs> Whoa. Stop the press. What's up with these character models, like man? It's like they've not loaded up properly. Don't look as good as until dawn. Can I fight? Hey, give me a quarter. Why? I'm gonna find out my future. Let's have it. What's in store for me? Joe. Oh, post World War II. Ooh, what should we choose? I guess I just want to know about my son. 
Will he, uh... Is he gonna grow up all right? Things gonna work out for him? Let's use the dragon tail. Look at the tile. Tell me what you see. It fish. He's not going to sleep with the fishes, is he? <laughs> Oh, fuck, say. Death. Wait, what? What does that mean? Hey, what does that mean? What the hell, man? Treats. We love the treats. Okay, so these are his traits. Insecure, selfish, reckless, altruistic. Ah, oh, I should have asked the question, will I be rich then at that fortune teller? That would have been more to his uh, character, but fuck it. Let's continue. Hey, bud. Let me get a go at it. Oh, yeah? Think you got the stuff? Fight? Sure. I feel like their facial details are too smooth and that the details haven't loaded. That's what it seems like to me. I'll give it a whirl. Oh wow, that's cool for back then. Missed the fuck. How did I miss that? Hey, Chuck, we better get back to the ship. We don't want to get stranded. Come on, man, just let me ask another question. We really need to get. Why aren't the subs on, man? So, check the traits. Still the same. I'm gonna have to uh, put the subtitles on. It's really annoying not having them on. I'm so I'm so used to having them on. I I prefer them on. Just because that way, if I can't understand what they're saying, because they mumble or the the voice volumes, though, I can still read it. Wonder what that means. Poison. they doing oh fucking hell it's hard to tell if they were serious or fucking around these men appear to be drunk 
off their rear ends. Get this one to the medical room. Throw the other in the brig and keep him there. Idiots, man. They're like teenagers. <laughs> I wonder if this is the ship the Urang. No way. going to reanimate the corpses. Flashbacks. Come back soon. What the fuck? I did not expect that. Check his face out. What the hell caused him to fucking die? Is there a note on that table did I miss? Oh, I didn't mean to press that. Nope. Alright. I can tell this game's going to make me jump at some point. Or multiple points. Where do we go? Left or right? Oh, there's only one way to go. Now, I'd be well claustrophobic on a ship like this. No escape, you know, if that water comes pouring in. Howdy, Charlie. How's your time off? Oh, just get me out of here already. What the hell's going on up there? I heard aircraft and gunfire. Me too. And there was a... a corpse. What? In the sick bay. Something's wrong. Let's get out of here. No, wouldn't that guy go, what? Let me see. Actually, let's see if there's anything in his cell. It's a motherfucking safe, boy. Oh, no code. Not yet, anyway. We got here. In that Private Charles Anderson on leave from duty did ex display intoxication in a manner not becoming of a member of the US Army. Private Anderson was engaging with another soldier in a drunken argument. It is the opinion of the arresting officer that this would lead to a public brawl and steps were taken to ensure that both men were returned to their ship.
can't go in the cell. Holy shit. It's blood. How is that doing up there? Arthur Miller, pri Private Arthur Miller. Petty theft, one day brig, small items belonging to senior officer found in Miller's pocket. Items recovered and returned to owner. Wednesday. David Davis, private, trespassed two days brig, found off limits in cargo hold 3A with no reason to be there. Flagrant disregard for orders. Friday. Private first class, Louis Brand, public intoxication, one day. Brig, found drunk and acting inappropriately for US Army personnel while on shore leave. Robert Reed, public intoxication, one day brig, found drunk and acting inappropriately for US Army personnel while on shore leave. Saturday, Charles Anderson, private, public intoxication, brawling, 10 days brig, found drunk and acting inappropriately for US Army personnel while on shore leave. Last one, Joseph Roberts, private, public intoxication, brawling, 10 days brig, found drunk and acting inappropriately for US Army personnel while on shore leave. Assigned to sick bay for medical treatment prior to internment. I think that was us. So no codes on there. I know the camera's not facing that way, but I always try and go the other way, so you never know. The overall graphics though are awesome. Maybe it's driving the people crazy. It's like seeing things. Gotta be seeing things or something, man. in there cool let's check this out it's locked you need a key to open this area that that shit's got to affect their minds whatever it was I really do hope we find out what it is don't know whether to have a look down there or or what shall I do Probably should have gone down into that fucking door. Just fail it so I can go back. Good, good, good. Oh, we have to go there anyway. <laughs> Fuck's sake. I thought I'd miss something. Yeah. 
Yeah, you said it. Fubar and then son. The fuck is going on, man? Oh, he's been shot up. What is going on here? God damn, another stick? Oh, damn it. Buckle. It's like they scared to death. So it looks like he ain't got any physical wounds from what we can see. Oh, it looks like we're going where it says danger on the wall. wondering whether I should go back and check what's down there that other route I'm so indecisive it's unreal but I just don't want to split up from him fuck it I'll stick together yeah, we don't know what the fuck's gonna happen what if oh my god that just shit me up fucking headset so loud You must bring out your personal fears. We've seen that motherfucker twice now, and where he's ran, there's dead bodies. So part of me is like, mm, I should go back. Charlie, get over here! Some have been shot. What's happened to these ones? We're gonna have to kill our fucking fellow soldiers. Fear toxin, like the scarecrow in Batman. <laughs> That's that gas in it. Hey, come here. God no. Charlie! Why don't you just walk in with him? Okay, yeah. Scared to death. Holy shit.
Looks like the anchors are down by those chains on the front. Is their fears, biggest fears. It's literally to me, it's like they're scared to death. That that gas or whatever it was in there brings out your biggest, deepest fears. like a good like horror TV show uh, intro probably get a copyright fucking thing for this song 